Hey, hey everybody, this is Larry. I'm doing this poem as part of a contest, so you're gonna watch me live as I go through my thoughts as I'm coding. Uh, there'll be an explanation near the end, and for more context, there'll be a link below on the actual screencast of the contest. Uh, how did you do? Let me know how you do. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, and here we go. Well, yeah, Q1, shuffle the way. So this one, uh, oh yeah, that, and now you can see me just going back and forth, seeing whether uh, it fits. The Q1, shuffled it away. Mm -hmm. So basically right now I'm just reading the problem. Uh, basically I knew how, I mean this is actually literally just what mathematically is called the perfect shuffle, which means you take half the deck, left and right, and then you put it interleave it one at a time. Uh, and what I did is I just used the two pointers. I have a pointer to the left and pointer to the right. And I just double checked that uh, the length of the array is is even, because if it's odd, then you have to do something smaller. Uh, I have a typo here, but, but because this problem is so straightforward that it's easy to, and then I check that it's accepted on the other problem. Um, this hmm. problem is so straightforward that I was like, oh, wait, oops. but the answers are wrong. And I'm like, oh, uh, when you yeah, test I am bad at math. Uh, Matt better type one, and after looking at that, I was like, okay, that looks shuffled away. So I did these a little bit out of order because if you watch the stream, I the internet was just having issues, so that also didn't help. It was I, I wasn't sure if it was my internet or lead codes because it seems like other people are. Other people are having the same issues with the internet. Okay, let's go. Whew, sorry. Shuffle the array. Given an array nums instead of two n elements of this, we turn the array of the form. Okay, yeah, so this one is just pretty straightforward in that you just, it is a classic shuffle uh, method. Basically, you take, what, what I did was that I just have two pointers, right? One, or, or, starting at point of one and then second one starting at, at the middle and then just move one at a time and that's basically what I did here with the pointer to the left and then an implicit pointer to the right which is plus half the array right and then after that we put it in the answers and then that's pretty much for Q1 yeah um, and the only thing that I had to double check was whether it's odd or even because if it's odd then maybe we have to well then we probably get an off by one even if uh, and an index error uh, but, but this was not the case, so that's good. Uh, yeah, pretty straightforward problem. Uh, reason, I mean, I don't think this would be an interview question, but it would be part of a bigger interview question. Because definitely, I've seen people give interviews on, on like, hey, here's you know a deck of cards, you know, shuffle it with the perfect shuffle or something like that, right? So these things, um, you should probably be practiced on and. Yeah, we, this is during a, uh, a competitive programming, but it also comes up enough during competitive programs to definitely recommend it. Uh, yeah.